rest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Portugal versus Argentina. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. The Argentina first team. Well, when they don't have possession, it will be a back five. But when they win the ball back, the wing backs will push further forward to make it a 3 5 2. And the contest begins. Rodrigo de Paul. Now there to intercept. Well, it's been a long and winding road to the final for Portugal. It's worth remembering that they finished second in the qualifying group. They had to go through playoff matches against Turkey and North Macedonia just to get to the 2022 finals. And this past month has been challenging as well, but they're here and they have a well-earned track record as winners. Well, you're absolutely right, but I think they've got better and better as the tournament has worn on. They've got a great understanding of what's required of each player on the pitch. They're good tactically, they've been fit, and I think they've got every chance of being the world champions here, but they're going to have to play well. And given his magnificent form, then there's every reason to believe that Cristiano Ronaldo will make an impact here. Well, Derek, we know he's a good all-round finisher, but I think his greatest attribute is his head inability. He seems to hang in the air, he's got great technique when the ball comes onto his head, and he usually hits the target. That's his greatest skill. Alvarez. McAllister, Marcos Acuna. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? So we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there, he's not going to take any messing about here. Guerrero. Felix. Could take the lead. And there it is. Living history. The opening goal of the 2022 World Cup final. Incredible celebrations.
Well, as the replay shows, it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line. And in the 1v1, Fernandez makes no mistake. He never really looked like missing, did he? What a goal that is. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Messi, De Paul, a fine use of the ball. Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Fernandes, Joao Felix. And back with Emiliano Martinez. Oh, he's really up on the map here. Oh, tremendous goalkeeping. But now it grinds to a halt because the flag has been raised. McAllister, Enzo Fernandez, Nahuel Molina, Messi, can he get them level? Oh, the equaliser, just what they needed, and the dream remains very much alive. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength, and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Ottavio. Well, high marks for that pass. Determined defending. Ottavio. Take some progress with the ball at his feet. Could be! Well, favouring placement over power, but that's a moment he would like to forget all about. Molina, Rodrigo de Paul, Messi, just the challenge that was required, useful looking position you've got to say, Not borderline offside but correct, Bernardo Silva on the ball Joao Felix and attempting the through ball oh a goal they're in the lead here now well here's the replay and what a well delivered cross this is perfectly placed and then the shot could not be hit any better struck with such venom great goal It is here. Marcos Acuna.
Messi. Difficult to stop him. It did look. Well, it's been difficult for the Portuguese to get hold of the ball, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. Guerrero. Physically strong and secure on the ball. Has a go. And a fantastic diving save. Elects to go short. Diesch. Can he find the net? Oh, good work by the keeper. But he's gone short with it. Bernardo Silva. The ball with Pepe. And he takes on the shot. Superb block. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. McAllister. Oh, great vision. Opportunity it is. drama well as the replay shows it all started with that perfectly weighted ball over the top of the back line and his movement so clever once he gets onto it there's only one thought in his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal Is that for the first half here? Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Neves. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. Messi. Moving it forward. Strength and control, a big part of his game. And players waiting in the centre. Messi. A fine use of the ball. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Dallo. Big chance. Oh, it's in. They're in front here. Now can they stay in front? Well, here it is again. It was a good finish, but the keeper has to do better at his near post. He was beaten far too easily on that occasion. Well, neutrals are getting their money's worth. 3-2 in this match. De Paul and the advantage accrues to the attacking side good looking sequence gives it a go oh really commanding goalkeeping 
for Nansch. Bernardo Silva. Otavio. And do they mean business on this occasion? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Lionel Messi. Messi. Still behind, but the pressure mounting. And keeping it out. Short corner it is. And that was simply miles off target. Well, I think he's right to go for power, but he's made the wrong connection, and it's really poor technique in the end. in the right place to intercept plenty of support here and he takes it on and the keeper there to deal with it well another wonderful save to add to his portfolio Ruben Dias Rafael Leao Guerrero Leal. It's there for him. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. And they will make the change now. Short corner favourite. Neves and return to Silva corner it is and an opportunity for Portugal to make it look even better and the play stop they will make the change now They favoured a short one here. Leal. Onto Ronaldo. And strong play here. In search of space. Joao Cancelo. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. 15 minutes left for play. Marcos Acuna. Takes the shot. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. fancy a short one very quick thinking there well let's see what they have in store for them on the break for Nansch. just 10 minutes remaining here he's in behind oh a stellar piece of defending Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. And he'll take efforts like that all day long. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Well, do they have a goal in the future? They're giving it a go. 
intercepting it intelligently. Can they hit on the break? Well, it was a good counter-attack in the making, but very alert defending. Di Maria. Rodrigo de Paul. Is with Paredes. Di Maria. And not quite accurate enough, Stuart. Well, I think he should do better there, but at least they're now knocking at the door. Silva we will have three minutes of additional time at the end here and the referee spotted the foul but has played advantage they might be able to get in now oh that is a superb save Rodrigo de Paul on to Messi they get forward but time is very much against them here Paredes. And now it's all over. We've witnessed history. Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time. Well, they've been kings of Europe. Now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. the world champions and this is finally Portugal's time fully deserved best team in the world well you have to give credit to the coach he's been excellent but so too the players and these fans it's absolutely magnificent for them